Hello my dear students welcome to Prudence Coaching English class in this particular channel you will find ICSE CBSE and WBBSE solutions today's topic is the toy box and here we will see answer the following questions choose the best answer reference to the context working with words and learning our language means all the things you are going to get in this particular video so let's start first we will start with answer the following question first question is what sounds did the children hear after entering the grounds in their car answer the children heard the birds twittering bees buzzing and the crunching of gravel under the car wheels after entering the grounds number 2 how do we know that the children like the wick in their old house before they moved out answer we know that the children like the wick in their old house before they moved out because it is described as a magical playground in which they had fun living with boxes everywhere question number 3 in what way was matilda's first impression of the new house different from tom's answer matilda's first impression of the new house was different from tom's as she described it as beautiful went straight in and started unpacking tom on the other hand says it looks scary next question when and where did tom first hear a cry what was his reaction tom heard a cry on the first day when he was alone in the playroom his reaction was to think it was a cat or his imagination question number 5 what did tom's mother tell tom to give him the courage to return to the playroom to check that there were no strange sounds answer tom's mother told him not to be a scaredy cat and said that the sounds must have come from outside scaredy cats means someone who gets frightened easily next question what did tom see out of the window how did this contrast with the inside answer tom saw the garden outside the window everything in it looked bright and warm and green and fresh the house in the contrast is described as dark and cold with echoing rooms and strange sounds next question question number 7 What did Tom's father take with him to investigate the coal bunker and why? Answer: Tom's father took a three iron, a golf club with him when he went to look into the coal bunker. He took it as a form of defense against the intruder the family had heard through the vent. Question number 8: How did Tom's constant screaming affect his parents and Matilda? answer tom's constant screaming made his parents come running to check on him and matilda also blamed him for the moodiness of their parents number 9 where did all rubbish at the side of the house come from answer the rubbish at the side of the house had been dumped there when the house was renovated Question number 10 Tom describes the house in his own way what is his view about the house does the view change when and why answer tom describes the house in his own way his view of the house is that it is cold scary rambling mansion that is towering high and spooky with echoing rooms his view changes when the mystery of the morning toy box has been solved and the family have settled in he says that the spooky house became a warm and comforting home question number 11 the woman her husband and daughter were obviously taken care of in the end what is your view about how and why they got there in the first place answer here the first place means the coal bunker where the woman her husband and daughter took shelter 
because they had nowhere to live and found the place by chance before the narrator and his family shifted in their new accommodation let us move to the next one choose the best answer we have been given an incomplete sentence we need to complete it by choosing the best possible answer tom did not like the house because correct option will be it was cold damp and spooky next one tom's parents were annoyed with tom because they thought he had made up a story to get their attention let us move to the next one answer the following question with reference to the contest we have been given a contest based on that we need to answer the following question here the contest is and just in case i am taking a golf club first question is who said these words answer will be tom's father said these words next question why does the speaker say just in case in what case answer he takes a golf club as a precaution he is worried about who might he find in his coal bunker next question what club does he take and what does he do with it he takes a three iron and he swings it in the air as they walk along let us move to the next reference to context father entered the room at a gallop why did father enter the room in this fashion answer the father entered the room in this fashion to respond to his son's scream what did he find in the room at this time he found tom matilda and his wife in the room at this time next one what did he do in the room and immediately after this he starts speaking in the room but stops when he sees his wife indicating with one finger on her lips to him to be quiet after this they all go into the living room where tom's mother explains what they have heard then tom's father goes to the play room to investigate next one here are some nouns from the passage but the letters are scrambled you need to unscramble the letter here the first one is lawn next one is toys next one is blossoms next one is rubbish next one is playroom number f is medicine next one is staircase and last one is husband next give the full form and explain the following abbreviations first one is ba ba means bachelor of arts dir means director this one is doctor degree f means degree fahrenheit fri means friday this one is january next one is mph means miles per hour r means mr mrs means mistress nov is november nw means north west kg means kilogram mar means month now let us move to the proverbs here we have been given some of the proverbs and we need to write the meanings of this proverbs number a all roads lead to rome it means there are many ways of achieving the same aim or the same results number b everything comes to him who waits if a person tries hard enough and is patient he or she will have success in the end next one if at first you don't succeed try 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 again a good result can be achieved with perseverance next one is it never rains but it pours it means misfortunes seldom come alone or you can say someone experiences two or three calamities that come one after the other next one is make hay while the sun shines it means make use of good opportunities when they present themselves let us move to the next one find the verbs and the object in the following sentences we know subject is the doer of the action verb is the action itself and the object or the direct object is the receiver of the action done by the subject the first 
sentence Matilda scolded her brother here Matilda is the doer of the action therefore it is the subject scolded is the action performed by Matilda so it is the verb and the action is being performed on her brother so here her brother is the object next one the woman is the subject wanted is the verb and the medicine is the object next one I am here I is the subject taking is the verb a golf club is the object next one the children's father here the children's father is the subject found is the verb and and here went is the object next one the father is the subject hit is the verb and the door is here the object number e the mother is the subject put is the verb the clothes is the object here next one the packers packed all the boxes the packers is the subject packed is the verb all the boxes here the boxes is the object we is the subject entered is the verb the playroom is the object my sister is the subject here blamed is the verb and me is the object next one i pulled a couple of toys from the toy box here i is the subject pulled is the verb and a couple of toys is the object here number j is someone had used the doorway quite recently here someone is the subject had used is the verb and the doorway is the object here next we need to match the following or we need to write the synonyms of the given word cunning means crafty upset means distressed affairs means matters carefully means cautiously finished means completed live means dwelt deeply means profoundly plan means scheme swiftly means quickly pupil means student obedient means dutiful gathered means collected with this we come to the end of this class if you find the content of this video helpful for you then like this video and don't forget to subscribe this channel to get more videos like this and also press the bell icon on the youtube app and never miss another update from this particular channel till then stay happy stay tuned enjoy your day